<clears throat> you are watching Endeavor TV with the Asus EPC P101PX, which costs 250 euros uh, here in Europe and is one of the cheapest uh, netbooks right now. I'm going to um, demonstrate to you how to upgrade your RAM and your hard drive without voiding the warranty. And yeah, let's just get started. This is the black version as you can see. And if you just want to upgrade your RAM, the only thing you have to do is unscrew this one little fella right here and take off the lid. And then you can already see the one gigabyte A data RAM stick. Um, this is a Sodin DDR2 RAM. You can upgrade it to maximum of two gigs if you just um, press the, these uh, metal arms here to the side and then it already pops out and then you just have to take the RAM stick out of the case like that and as you can see this was pretty easy the shorter side is on the left so if you put back in the 2 gigabyte um, RAM stick you just have to make sure that you put it in all the way so you can't see the contacts on the bottom anymore the golden contacts and then you just push it down till goes back in again and yeah this is actually it put back on the lid the, the plastic lid put uh, a screw back inside and you are done if you want to do more like upgrading your hard drive all you have to do is take out this one little screw here and another four on all the corners so there's five on the bottom plus the one from the lid take out the battery flip it to the other side and then you have to take out the keyboard um, taking out the keyboard is not that easy but if you take out the battery and use a plastic card you don't need anymore like this one is a triple a card go in here and then lift the keyboard up i already did that so this is loose in here right now but as you can see you have four spots here that are holding the um, keyboard make sure if you do it not to start in the corner because the metal is going to um, yeah, bend and it's going to look pretty ugly if your delete button is up like that in the corner. So make sure to start in the middle with these two contacts. After you have finished taking out your hard drive and unplugging it from here, uh, make sure to unplug also the touchpad here, right there. Um, and then you have another one, two, three four five six screws that you have ta have to take out here as you can see here we have a sticker which is which says that you void the warranty of the whole device if you void the sticker um, but it's pretty easy to just lift that up if you go in there and lift it up because it's over a hole so i was able to get out the screw without um, damaging the sticker after you did that you need your card again and you have to go around the whole case so you can lift up the plastic I already did that of course also and so this is pretty loose for me right now and then you can already take off this case so then you can see the innards and yeah well um, the CPU and everything every main thing is actually on the other side as you can see here we have the hard drive already which is only um, hold in the case or held in the case with, with this one little screw which I already took out also um, this cable connects the two main boards just have to lift this plastic up on both sides like that and then you can slip it out already to take out the hard drive and then you just have to unplug it like that and then you already have the 160 gigabyte Seagate hard drive in your hands and can change this to an SSD or anything else if you take out the other four screws here and yeah um, put in something else with a two and a half inch size and SA, uh, SATA 2 ports so as you can see you have a lot of space here on the bottom so you can add just anything you want like a, I don't know um, a TV card DVB-T card or you can if you only want to use the, your 3G and uh, you don't need wireless then you can unplug this PCI Express card here and put in a really long different card uh, for um, maybe a MiFi or anything else 
but there is actually not too much space for modding as you can see here this is the 1001px as it says here there is a uh, high resolution pictures on endevil.com thank you for watching i am balash gal this was the asus epc um, 1001px uh, ram and hard drive upgrade putting it back together is as easy as taking it apart um, good luck with upgrading and thank you for watching.